This is a video for a request that I had. Someone wanted to know how I ran uh, power to the back of my 4Runner uh, so that I could use a Blue Sea Systems panel uh, for accessories and such. We'll open up the engine compartment. Latch is on the inside left. Went with a Group 27F X2 Power, made by Northstar, made in the U.S. Uh, four gauge wire, positive, negative, lugs and wire was U.S. Uh, it's running to a Blue Sea Systems circuit breaker uh, that I use as an internal switch in the engine compartment. Both the positive and negative will run through the engine compartment electrical uh, boot. Then they were ran underneath the steering wheel into the panels here, down to the kick panels. The B pillar was a problem. There was very little room. That was the worst of any of it. Most of the measurements were done ahead of time, and I lost maybe about three or four inches trying to run it through and come back out. So the positive was actually a little longer. But we ran it through the panel and the side panel in to over the wheel well and then to the back where I had another circuit breaker, 100 amp circuit breaker. And from here I've got a switch that I can cut it on and off. And then I've got a switch in the engine compartment to cut it on and off. I've got one cigarette adapter, two USB adapters to charge with, and then also an accessory mount. Uh, directly from the front uh, on a 50 amp circuit breaker for a fridge or my air compressor, things like that. Wasn't a really quick install because you had to crimp and solder and then also the shrink wrap. Uh, had to do all the shrink wrap and all, but we it's a very good investment. Uh, we've used it uh, anytime I can actually cut it off. So that's the overview. I'll try and put some more information in there, uh, what, what, what I used, but just wanted to do a quick video on it. Thanks for watching.